Well, it's slightly off the beaten track, but it's a football venue that simply oozes passion. We're here at the Stadion an der Altenförsterei in Köpenick. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Bundesliga. It's Union Berlin, and they take on RB Leipzig. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, on paper, it looks a fairly cautious approach because unless their wing backs can get into more advanced areas, I'm not sure where the attacking width will come from. Let's have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Well, the player that needs to affect the game is the one at the top of the midfield, Diamond. If he can get on the ball and dictate the play, they should control this match. And they kick off here. Forsberg. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Leipzig pushing forward with options available. It's looking promising. Forsberg. Can they slot it home? In it goes at the second time of asking. But the goalkeeper won't be proud of that moment. Well, when you look at this again, there's two things wrong defensively about this. First of all, the goalkeeper should not be parrying it into a dangerous area, and the defenders have to be sharper to get to the knockdown. It's not good defending all round. moving again what sort of response will we see from them now Krummer on attacking possibilities textbook defending inside the box Paulsen Aydara take it away Nkunku could be dangerous oh he's lost possession oh really good reflexes and danger averted Who can he pick out? And clears the danger. Nordi Mukieli has a go. Well, just narrowly over the crossbar. Good hit, though.
getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. And Leipzig in a position of menace. It needs an accurate cross. Mukiele crossed into the penalty area. Plattered away. Nkunku. Forsberg. Oh, well hit, but couldn't keep it down. Paulsen, Camper, will he finish? And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. We'll just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. the best challenge free kick well now he's walking on eggshells you might say next time it'll be yellow Well, as you can see, Leipzig have controlled the possession. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Nkunku. The ball with Kampel. Angelino. Superb block. One block after another. Oh, it might be. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Who's going to get on the end of it? So it's going to be a goal kick here. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. He's playing with real authority and attack, Stuart. Yeah, he's been brilliant, hasn't he? He looks such a threat every time he gets the ball. And, of course, he scored a very good goal. Kedira. Leipzig with the ball again. Angelino on to Forsberg they really look after the ball when they have it and now passing it through and it goes well it's one goal after another a highly impressive performance Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing to keep him do about that. And 
and with that the first half draws to a close what a performance of authority in the first half from Emil Forsberg what did you make of his contribution yeah good first half performance obviously with the goal but with so many chances falling to him you wonder whether he could have had two or three by now but I wouldn't be too surprised though if he ends up with the match ball as he does look a real threat So back underway, and it really was dizzying stuff from Leipzig in the first 45. Will it be more of the same from them in the second half? Andre Silva, Amadou Haidara, on to Mugiele. Forsberg, Haidara. The ball with Kampel. Aboniyi. And in possession, Trimmel. Crossing opportunity. No worries for the keeper. Mohamed Simakon and continues his run and teammates to play it to and they'll get ready for the throw in and the substitution will occur now And intercepted it. And good pressure high up the pitch. The referee correctly to some great opportunity. He's foiled them on his own. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Camper. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Precise ball movement. Angelino. Forsberg. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, as you can see here, the build-up is patient, it's precise and penetrative, which opens up the opposition, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. 20 minutes to go. Running with the ball confidently. But nothing comes of it. Nkunku. Here's Mukiele. Danny Olmo. Campbell. Is it going to be? Interception to snuff out the danger. Well, straight at the goalkeeper then. Andreas Vogelsama. Chance to finish. And fired against the crossbar. And he did what he had to do defensively. It looks promising. Rani Kadira here. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. 
And it comes down to the final five minutes. A very timely interception. Campo. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow-through. It's so athletic. That's a dynamic strike. performance in this particular game will have impressed many people Stuart well I have to say that was impressive not just his goals but his all-round play he was excellent 